To prepay vacation, come to the left side of the screen and click a plus sign underneath the final row. When the line appears, go to the pay code column, click into there, scroll down and click vacation prepay. It's important that you choose prepay, not pay out, which is for the end of the year for any vacation time not used. And standard vacation is what you use if you're paying it on the day that they're taking it. To prepay vacation, you choose vacation prepay. In amount, you put the number of hours. So in this example, we're gonna use 40. And then you need to click out so the number of hours populates and then articulate what days the vacation is going to be used for by right-clicking on the box, clicking comments, and adding a comment type of vacation prepay and listing the dates that the vacation is going to be used for. So we're going to put 419 to 425. Hit OK. And then click Save. It is important that the comment with the number of hours listing for what time frame is saved. This way we can approve the payroll.